Hello and welcome to RB Studios. Today I'm going to be doing some image retouching and the goal of today is to see how far I could take this image utilizing Lightroom and Photoshop. Lightroom, I like to do my initial edits. Honestly, Lightroom really excels at editing batch photos. So when working on portraits, I get 70% of the way there. And then I like to bring all of the images over into Photoshop. For this image, I did some basic color correction, fixing white balance, editing contrast, and brightening our hair. Um, but besides that, I really needed to take it to Photoshop to make things really pop. In contrast to Lightroom, Photoshop really isn't made for batch edits. You could spend hours upon hours healing the skin and dodging and burning certain aspects of the image. To get around these shortcomings, I've created some actions that help heal the skin and get most of the dodging and burning done. It does most of the heavy lifting, but I just wrap some things up with some minor touch-ups here and there. be straightforward I'm not really the biggest fan of the liquify tool there's a very thin line you have to be aware of when you're editing photos you want to accentuate someone's features you don't really want to take it so far that you offend your client so in this image I chose to gently accentuate the lips of the client and then to top it all off I did some dodging and burning to draw some attention to the lips They say that the eyes are the windows to the soul. So lastly, I chose to make some edits to emphasize the eyes. I think the goal here really is to make some subtle changes. When you're focusing on editing your client's eyes, I wanna draw attention to the eyes, but I do not want my client to look like they're from some type of horror film. So I just like to make some subtle changes, nice and gentle. And in this example, I think I did just that. So this is the final image. I feel like the edits we made really brought out the feature of the model. If you have any questions or you're interested in booking with us, please feel free to reach out at your earliest convenience. I'm looking forward to hearing from you soon. Take care.